So prior to a membership in our dental office, the hygienist and myself struggled at trying to continue what we call comprehensive care and following the ADA's guidelines in what needs to be done. So what I'm saying there, a patient would come in and we all would try to follow the ADA's recommended uh, guidelines on x-rays and fluoride and how often their teeth are cleaned. And we do, we try to follow that. But what happens if you're not on a membership, it makes it more difficult because the patients become a little bit more, well, can I push that off or can I push that off? So by trying to follow those guidelines, it becomes a little bit more difficult without a membership. Once you put a membership in your office, you are able to practice dentistry the way that you have been taught and the hygienists love it because there isn't that conversation and you're able to provide comprehensive care with, with the ADA's guidelines without the concern of what cost is gonna be.